I think it's the only weapon in the world that conjures up so much emotion immediately. That the AK-47 throughout history symbolises so much. It symbolises freedom, terrorism, revolution. The weapons killed the most people in the world. And then I had my personal experience in Afghanistan when I was serving with the British military when I, I was shot at with an AK-47. So I wanted to take something that symbolised all of that and turn it into something of peace. So today I'm finishing off the Texan flag AK-47 piece, which is called Virtue of the Vicious with blue butterflies, white butterflies to create the star, red butterflies and white butterflies for the two stripes. And then I'm doing the yellow rose of Texas, which is purely yellow butterflies. And then I'm gonna do a mixed medium butterflies, which is just species from all around the world. The butterflies kind of summarize a lot for me the symbolism of a butterfly's uh, person's spirit when they die. So this is a 7.62 round, which goes into an AK-47 magazine. And this is a 7.62 round that I've made of clear resin. And then uh, I fill them up with the commodity that's associated with the art piece. It's all about the commodities of conflict. So you've got oil, gold, diamonds, opium poppy seeds, earth, to represent land, blood, and then there's uh, cocaine to go in and religious symbols. So this is a, a petal from a yellow rose to represent the yellow rose of Texas, uh, which is in the Texan flag AK-47 and the, the yellow rose AK-47 piece. While I'm actually making it, I reflect a lot really on my experiences in life and uh, it's quite a calming, therapeutic action really because you're, you're working with such delicate things and you, you really zone in and go into your own little world. America is a gun culture. I personally don't have issues with that but what I have issues with is that it's so readily available. When I was here last and the ATF stops um, my art pieces coming in, within 15 minutes of being in the gallery, someone came up to me and said, you want an AK-47, I can get you on here tomorrow, I can order it online. And that was the irony of the whole issue in the first place. I couldn't get a decommissioned weapon that was a piece of artwork into the country, but I could literally go down the high street and buy one over the counter. A lot of thought process goes in and research to the pieces. I did a Virtue of the Vicious French flag AK-47, which was the tricolour French flag, um, after the shootings in Paris, where 130 people got shot by AK-47s. So I actually put 130 butterflies on there to represent 130 people killed. I mean, I personally don't have an issue with weapons. They're tools. I think it's more about the hands that the weapon's in. I have an issue with how easy it is to get weapons. A lot of people are taken back by the beauty of the butterflies and then when they scratch a surface and they realise the more you dig, the more layers there are to the piece. 